Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be redeeming my first Webkin's Deluxe membership. A proper one, not just those deluxe previews, but a proper membership. And so, lately I've been getting back into Webkin's. When I logged on today, I saw that they were having a 50% off for deluxe membership for just a few days. And I just happened to see that, so I thought, why not? I was already considering getting a deluxe membership anyway, because I've been getting more into Webkins lately. Then I saw this, 50% off. So this is going to be not a short video, it's... I'm going to be doing multiple things. Also, today happens to be deluxe day, so there's even more extra things that I'll be getting, so that's pretty cool. Even more goodies! That's really cool looking, by the way. That's a really nice purple and cyan. So, without further ado, let's get the membership. So, we get 5,000 one-time points, which is cool, and then 3k monthly. An Aurora Fawn with a very creepy smile. It kind of reminds me of the Cheshire Cat. And then really cool wallpaper and flooring, Aurora Borealis. And finally, a cool looking hat. Northern Lights hat. So, promo code right here. I'll just put this in. Guys, because of um, like an error, I put something in wrong, it almost didn't do the discount code. I was like, why does it still say the same amount? And then I went back and then put everything in again. Read the fine print, okay? So yeah, let's do this. You are now a Webkin's World Deluxe member! Yay! So yeah, let's head on to the actual game and see all my goodies! Aww. Congratulations! You've earned the Deluxe Member Badge! It has been added to your My Badges Collection! There they are, 8,000 Gans Easter points. But anyway, I'm just in my um, Christmas barn. So let's see what I got in the mail. Ooh, a deluxe member hat. Yay! A Northern Lights hat! Congratulations! Ooh, I kind of don't want to delete these messages. <laughs> I'm gonna keep them for now. So, the rest of the stuff, they came in their separate virtual code, so... I'm gonna redeem those while I try to think of a name for this fawn. Here's what the deluxe membership hat looks like. That's what the Northern Lights hat looks like. But for now, the first thing I'm gonna do is complete this deluxe challenge because they did a little membership preview for a few days and I almost got all of them until it ran out because I didn't have time to spin the deluxe wheel for the third time. So finally, I'm gonna get that neon bowling alley, which looks really cool. And I'm gonna use it for a cool looking retro bowling alley. Let's do this. Oh, oh. So yeah, got these cool stuff. Today is also a special day because I get to spin the wheel of the month. Or should I say, the wheel of the month. <laughs> Dang it. This is basically like free gambling in a kid's game. <laughs> so, I also received a May 2023 deluxe gift box. <laughs> Oh sweet, it comes with more than just the grass shoes. So we also got a deluxe medallion gift box, retro rainbow themed gift box, and a wish token. Let's see what's in here. Oh sweet! Oh nice. Ooh. Not bad. Let's see what's in here. Ah oh, man, it's like a super bad- dang it. Um. Hmm. Dang it, why do you do this to me? Okay, that looks really cool, but pauf the <laughs> pauf. I think I'm gonna have to go with the phone because it's the most unique item in the selection. So and oh, yep, knew it. It's a it's a wall item. Okay, it's not too small, but maybe I'll put that in my uh, like my 50 style restaurant. Who knows? Did you know? Oh, ooh. You know what? 
I think I can afford a pet that I've always wanted. And they're also doing like a Black Friday thing in May on the Gansey store as well. So I'm gonna have to do that as well. Next on the list, let's redeem that Aurora Borealis theme. It's so hard to say for some reason. Okay. Ta-da! Ooh, I can't wait to see what it looks like in a room. And here's the flooring. Yay! Ooh, it looks like cracked ice. Oh my gosh, you know what? This looks like- <gasps> I could make a long dark themed room. Oh my gosh, that's going to be amazing. <gasps> that's perfect, because that almost looks like Mystery Lake. Ooh, no, not Mystery Lake, uh, Coastal Highway with like the cracked ice and stuff at night. Oh, and like the Aurora Borealis in the sky. That's so perfect. I'll be back when I think of a name for the Aurora Fawn. All right, guys, I am back and I have decided to name this Aurora Fawn Geo. Geode gemstones are really cool, by the way. They're so pretty. And he kind of looks like a geode, but I just like Geo. So, Geo the Aurora Fawn. Wow, that is a very wide smile. It's like Cheshire Cat. Whoa. That smile is not natural looking. <laughs> so, the Aurora Fawn box. Let's see what's inside. Ooh, so we got a Northern Lights Hot Air Balloon, Galaxy Macaron. That looks disgusting. <laughs> Pretzel, Zangles Chocolate Fountain, Welka Balloon, and a bonus gift box. Boom, boom, boom! It's just more money. So, oh yeah, and uh, here's the postcard. Ah, there he is. So, I'll be back in a sec while I decorate with these and then show you Geo's room and clothes. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna be the permanent room name, but for now, it's, it'll just be that. Ooh, it's like a proper, like, mountain and valley. Ooh, like the Alaskan wilderness. It's a really seamless connection. It's really cool. got oh my that's big I also got this item included with the deluxe membership somewhere teacups somewhere beyond the sea somewhere Alright guys, I am back and I also have decided, since there's that uh, Black Friday in May sale, I'm going to get a pet that I've always wanted, which is the Griffin! And so yeah, it's 40% off from that sale. And check this out. The old menu thing pops up for the adoption. Ain't that cool? 
So, this guy's name is gonna be Blaze. So, let's do this. Why? <laughs> Why does it extend my. F oh, like. The oh, the adopting full membership. Oh, I was like, wait, two deluxe memberships in one day? No, no. And, um, I used to play a game called Fate the Cursed King. And one of the options you could have as a pet was a phoenix. I always named him Flame and stuff like that. And at first I thought this was a phoenix, but no, 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 it's a griffin. But it's a very fiery looking griffin, so. Yay! There he is. Wow. Looks so cool. One thing I find weird is, um, how the feet in the corner are propped up so you can see the bottom of the feet like that instead of just like a regular feet sitting down with the toes at the bottom and stuff. And it's cool that how it also flies. Something I want to do one day is make a physical plushy version of this pet because I always like when they always have their physical counterparts and vice versa. Otherwise it just doesn't feel like the full thing, you know? And once I do make that plushie of uh, the griffin, I'll make a video about it. But I digress. Let's feed this guy so I can get his present. A very cool scaly box. It doesn't say griffin pet box, just says griffin. <laughs> so I got the fable fireplace, shimmering sapphire skewers in orange, zero statue, green welcome balloon, and a bonus gift box. <laughs> That's just a lugger. It's a safe and sound mini locker. So yeah. Here's his postcard. So yeah, I'll be right back. I'm gonna put some clothes on him and decorate his room and also show you the finished room of Geo's room. So be right back. Alright, so here is Geo's room. I got this little corner here, like a little room. The hot air balloon, and this cool snow globe trampoline that I forgot I had. There was a cabin at first, but then uh, it was getting a little cluttered, so I thought this more minimalist looking approach is fine. Here's also the hot air balloon, which you can ride. Whoa, it teleported there. <laughs> That was weird. Whoa! So here are Geo's outfits. Go away! There's this one. And then this one. I had a wizard outfit lying around from redeeming some trading card codes the other day. 
Look at those huge glasses on him, it looks ridiculous. Mm. So, that is not all. Now, I'm going to make a room for Blaze. So here is Blaze's room. The name of it is Blaze's Maze of Ekbaton. It's a nod to the name of the town from Fate the Cursed King. Anyone remember Wild Tangent Games? I could go on a tangent about that. So you got the fireplace, you got these, well, you got these cool portals and stuff which you can't actually go through unfortunately. You, you could go all the way here. I thought it would be interesting to put a maze in here because I have barely any of the Egyptian themed items because, you know, they're rare items that appear in Arties only. So I thought I would do a maze. Whee! There he goes, he's flying! You know, if he could really fly and had wings like that, he could just go over the mazes. But I guess, I guess he's a goody two-shoes and doesn't want to cheat. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, before I forget, so here's Blaze's outfit. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this long video. Yeah, adopting Blaze was not a planned thing. It wasn't planned. But nevertheless, I'll see you in my next video, webkins or otherwise. Goodbye!